What's up? It's Sunday. And this is Ambiguity. And this week we're gonna talk to our past selves and give them some advice. So these are some things I'd like to say to myself when I was younger. So here we go. <laughs> so hey, here's your future self. You've changed a shitload. <laughs> like you cannot even imagine how your life will turn out. Yeah, it's pretty crazy. <laughs> like you wouldn't believe who would be talking to you right now. And I can tell you, you will be much happier and way more yourself. Because I know you're pretending right now to be someone that you think everyone wants you to be and how you want yourself to be, which is even harder to overcome, I think. Yeah, it's gonna be a lot better. It's gonna be fucking great. And it's even gonna be greater because you're gonna go on testosterone and you're gonna get your boobs removed. Yep. <laughs> They're gonna go, like, for real. Like, your body's gonna match your inside. So, yeah, it's gonna be really cool. Also, I wanna say that don't be so afraid of being yourself. People will like you for it, and if they don't, then they're not worth your time. Say, and also, choose things you wanna do because you really want to do them. Like, you really like to do them. Don't do things you don't want to do because someone else might want you to do those things. This is particularly important for your choices of courses in your high school. Because <laughs> you're not gonna like chemistry and physics. Just don't do that stuff. Do whatever you want. But you'll be fine in the end. Like, you will go to a great university. You'll have the time of your life. It's gonna be really hard though. Really tough. But you're gonna be fine. Also, go on YouTube sooner. Because you're gonna find so many people like you who can tell you exactly why you feel the things that you're feeling. Because you're missing out, really. <laughs> it's a great community. And it's not something to be afraid of, or it's not weird or different. It's not the norm, maybe, or that's what they want you to believe. But it's, yeah, it's just really great. Great people, great minds. Another thing is that your parents' divorce is not your fault. It's not your dad's fault. It's not your mom's fault. It's, it isn't anybody's fault. It is what it is, and there's nothing you can change about it, and your life wouldn't be better if they were still together. Growing up in two different houses is going to be hard, but it's better than the alternative, I'm sure. Also to my teenage self, stay close to who you were as a kid, because that is who you are authentically, because that's when I was most myself, I know. And you will lose that in your teenage years. So stay close to that and you'll be fine. And you will find your way back to that kid from the past. So, yeah. Anyways, anything else I want to say? Don't quit all the, the sports that you're about to do or start. I know it's hard because it's, it's gender teams. But yeah, it's worth it. Like, you like sports a lot and you know you do. So keep doing it. Also start skateboarding. Don't be afraid, you'll be fine. I mean, you won't, you fall a lot, but it's so much fun. And there's so many pe great people out there that skateboard, so. My thing is that you are good enough. You are, and you are capable of being loved. Good enough to be loved. And a lot of people fall in love with you and you don't even notice it. <laughs> Give yourself some self-love. Anyways, that's it, and all the social media will be down below. We'll be, we're back on Instagram. It's mostly Theo and I are posting selfies. <laughs> so if you want to look at those, then you can check out our Instagram. Also, um, we're still active on Tumblr. And um, yeah, I put my link to my social, or to my personal YouTube channel as well. I'm posting more regularly right now. Like I'm gonna post every Thursday from now on. So if you want to check that out, Link in the description and yeah, that's it. See y'all guys next week. Bye